The Vine Uganda is truly a special place. What started out as just a Sunday school service for a few children has grown into an organization that serves thousands of people through our child sponsorship program, scholastic materials, prison outreach, medical camps, women's training and loans, and spiritual outreach that reaches all throughout the region of Kamuli, Uganda. It seems that whatever we dream becomes a reality because we're not afraid of the tough challenges of poverty. As a matter of fact, we see that as a chance to really trust God and to bring some wonderful news to a very needy place in Uganda. The Kamuli district of Uganda is greatly underserviced. There are many great international organizations that are helping in cities surrounding Kamuli, but Kamuli itself has very little in the way of social services. People come to us from miles and miles around just hoping to get some kind of help for their lives. The only thing that's really holding us back is room. We've outgrown our facilities, and last January, we were able to go purchase a beautiful piece of land where we plan to build. Our plans include a nursery and primary school, children's dormitories for the most needy and orphaned children to live, a women's center right there on our property that will house our tailoring school and community outreaches. We'll also have staff housing for our teaching staff and our administrators, as well as a church. We're excited to be able to have a church right there on our property that can be an open door to all the people in the villages and their surrounding areas of Kamuli. At The Vine, we are different than other organizations that merely sponsor a child or give services to the poor. Here, when we commit to a child, we commit to a child for life. We're going to provide for their physical, their spiritual, and their emotional needs. We believe that the children of Uganda are the future, and we want to make sure these children graduate high school and go on to college or vocational school. We are looking to raise up new leaders for Uganda. We also believe in second chances. We are now providing services to two of the largest prisons in the Kamuli District. We are also providing for their spiritual and their physical needs. As a single mom, I just really have a love for the women and the mothers of Uganda. These women are truly the backbone of this society and I relate to them. Um, many of these women have six plus kids on little to no income and they have to support them alone. And what I love about The Vine Uganda is that we really focus on empowering women. The Vine is about to open its doors to a new tailoring school where women have the opportunity to go in and learn sewing training for six months and come out with a certificate of completion, um, just a job well done, pride in their work, and be able to make articles of clothing that they can sell in Uganda and also in the US. And not only that, but the Vine gives personal loans out, so women can start their own small businesses and just start to get on their feet, um, providing for their families. I'm just so proud of these women and I'm honored to be a part of building up and empowering other women like myself. When I think about the future of The Vine, there really is no limit. We got our name, The Vine, from Jesus' words in the Gospel of John where he said, I am the vine, you are the branches. We're just the branches of his love for the people in Uganda. And there's no limit to that love.